Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope everybody is doing well. Uh, got a fantastic spotlight on a beautiful soap today. I hope you guys will all enjoy it. Uh, before we get to that, let's get to the tools that we're going to be utilizing today, the selection. We're going to pair this beautiful soap up that I'm going to show you in just a moment, although I'm sure you saw in the title what we're talking about, so you know, it's not so much of a hint. Uh, we're going to go with the Super Speed today. This is the TV commercial. This is the 1958 D2. Uh, love this little guy. This was a full rhodium revamp from Razor Emporium. I did a whole review on this. So if you want to see all the specs and details and uh, all my true thoughts and opinions on it, you know, you can always catch that in the library. But overall, just want to say it's Gillette Vintage. These guys are beautiful. This little Super Speed does a great job. We'll pair that guy up today and get him rocking and rolling with a nice persona med prep. Great blades. Love these blades. So let's get this guy just loaded in real quick. And actually, I'm going to drop it in like so. That beautiful. And I have as I said, oh, just nice little quarter turn there. Little blade overhang, as I stated previously. So just be mindful when you're when you're locking up. No big deal. Uh, as I stated previously in the last video, this isn't going to catch anywhere uh, around your ears or your nose. I've had no issues whatsoever. It's a beautiful little razor. Okay, so star of the show today is going to be Ladrino. Uh, this is beautiful. I mean, just take a look at this packaging, and, and not for nothing. Um, you know, you guys. I've commented previously about this. Um, razor Emporium should take note. $115 razor came in a plastic bag. That's just lame. This retail $32.99. I picked it up for $25.99 at uh, Pasteur, Pasteur Pharmacy out of New York City. Fantastic. Look at the packaging. Look at the attention to detail. Look how nice. They even have the little sticker on the back. And let me orientate this, orientate it the right way for you guys. I don't have glasses on, but uh, oh, hold on, let me see. All right. Shazam. Sorry about that. So it looks like it, the uh, retail on it's $32.99. I picked it up for $25.99. But come on, that's, that's beautiful attention to detail. So clearly, I have not smelled this soap, touched it, uh, nothing of that sort. So uh, we're going to delve into that today. So let's unseal this thing of beauty and see what we come up with but i mean come on I, I love the wax seal i just think that's so cool so don't mean to be putting razor for you on notice but come on so really nice wait a sec cutting right through it all right so i'm gonna leave the wax seal on there just you know just so we don't have to mess with too much but let's get that out of the way again ladrino beautiful job on the on the packaging that that's how you do it I, I just think that's fantastic and and then lo and behold let me just get that guy out of the way so nobody gets cut uh lo and behold look how beautiful the label is i mean just really really well done and give you guys all the side shots and so forth and this is tallow based so uh there's if you want to try to catch that you can see all the different ingredients so i haven't opened it up yet clearly haven't smelled it none of that sort nothing of that sort uh ladrino so from my understanding this is an italian gentleman who's expat now living in spain and providing them with amazing soaps from what i understand gonna find out indefinitely today and uh like i said tallow based la riviera it's supposed to be a play on the Italian Riviera, so uh, I imagine it's going to be citrusy and some floral in there. Uh, so this is 135 grams. So what are we talking, like 4.7 ounces off, off the top of my head? So, oof. Oh, wow. Man. Oh, that's nice. bit more floral coming out right off the pot, you know, initially, than I'm getting citrus. But, mmm. Oh, hot damn. That's uh, that's really nice. So I'll give you a look at that. And oh, it's creamy. Yeah. So it's very pliable. So I could see just I could just move it very easily. So this will, you know, and it's a tallow, so I'm sure it's going to lather up really nice. But 
Really beautiful floral scents. I mean, truly. That's really, really nice. Mmm. Let's lather it up. Let's hit it. Got the Beau Bramel bowl doing its thing. You guys know I love this bowl. And we're going to hit this today with the Mandalorian Silver Tip Badger Custom. I love this brush. Look at that. It's a thing of beauty. Let me get some of this in this bowl. Oh, man. That's really oh, it's nice. Let me drop this in here and we'll get cooking. Nice dollop. Okay, remnants right into the brush as per usual. Get a little hot water. And let's build her up. I'll build up a bit in the bowl. Look, <laughs> here, we, here we go. I mean, I just started. Wow, man, that's a, she's a runner. I mean, it's jumping. So, whoa, let me wet the face and we'll build up the rest on the face because I can see this thing wants to go. I'm about uh, a couple of hours out of the, out of hours out of the shower and uh, I've definitely got a good three days uh, growth. Oh man, beautiful smells. Beautiful smells there, Ladrino. Oh my goodness. I got the heat from the bowl. <laughs> We're going to have to get a little more soap on her, a little bit too much water. But, hmm, it's going. Maybe not. Mm. Whoa. Mmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Put in the ocean as well. Like I thought. I mean, it's lathering up. I mean, it's it it's going. I mean, you could see it's that's some nice density right there. Look at that. I mean, it's it is. Got some serious texture to it. There we go. Put that bowl down. Thought I was going to have to make a slight correction due to um, water, but she seems to have come really alive. Let me just rinse real quick. And that would have been on me, nothing to do with obviously the soap itself. But oh my God, the, uh, the floral scents. I'm not really getting, me personally, I'm not really getting anything um, citrusy. It's really very floral. It looks good. All right. I could do that all day, but let's get at it. Uh, really, really nice. Beautiful, beautiful smell. Uh, I'm sorry about the water. Uh, beautiful, beautiful smell. This is what we took out. So that was basically the scoop of the day. And uh, I, it's very, very fresh. 
I mean, it's it's just like a nice bouquet of floral scents coming at you. So so beautiful in that aspect. And uh, let's get at it with this little super speed. Oh yeah, nice, very nice. Tallow, as, as expected, uh, very, very slick, uh, not over slick, nice moisturized feel, nice, uh, nice texture to it. So look at that little guy. This razor is fantastic, I do love it. If you have the opportunity to grab one, I, I just think it's such a, such a great get. Uh, I have a hard time, a uh, hard time choosing between this one and my slim adjustable. I, I really, I, I really like this one. I think maybe because it's just no must, no fuss. I just, you know, load it up and go. Well, I mean, the adjustables are great, you know, but you know, my preference, uh, I just, it's so easy. Great feedback coming off of it. Oh God, that soap's beautiful. Seriously, that, that's just, oh my gosh, that's a wonderful, wonderful smell. Like a lilac, lavender. Ooh, man. I mean, take me to the Riviera. I didn't get much information, and you guys know I love to geek out about the saponification. I'm always on it, but I didn't get much detail as far as how they're processing stuff. Um, uh, let me just see my recorders going. Okay. Uh, as far as how they're, you know, processing the soaps and what, you know, different processes they use and so forth. So I don't have any super detailed stuff to tell you. I apologize. I thought my mic was about to turn off. That slight interruption. So I don't have a tremendous backstory. Um, maybe it's an opportunity where I can contact the manufacturer and, and get some of that because I think it's super important. I, I like to know how they're doing it, what are you doing, what are the processes and what processes uh, that you're using to make such a beautiful, wonderful soap. But let's get a let's get a feel for what's going on here. Razor, the Gillette, beautiful, love it. Oh man. Banging. Banging soap. Banging. Let's hit it again real quick. We'll keep this kind of, you know, kind of squared away, not uh, not crazy long, but uh, it deserves a second pass. It's, I mean, it's just, I mean, look at that. Look at that coming off there. I mean, that's a beautiful, beautiful texture. Whew. I mean, wow. And again, second pass, I'm going to go painter's brush. I don't think we need to go crazy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. Let's take it. Crosstown traffic. Beautiful. Um, the really nice 
slickness left behind, you know, making it really, really easy for this guy to do his job. I was really, really happy to see this soap pop up at uh, Pasteur. They, they do a great job too, by the way. If you guys haven't been buying from them, I mean, I have no affiliation with them at all, but um, they really process their orders so rapidly. Everything, it's always free shipping. I always get my stuff really, you know, so quickly, never an issue, not once. And uh, that speaks volumes. And they tend to get nice products like this in that a lot of places don't. So when I saw this pop up, so I keep an eye on them. Let me just get under here real quick. Uh, I was like, oh yeah, done. Send it. And I am really happy I did because, uh, oh, I love this scent. I've been getting hit with a lot of citrus lately, as you guys have seen the reviews, which is beautiful. I, I, I you know, the citrus is really just absolutely gorgeous. Um, but man, this is a nice little change up and uh, happy about that. Let me just check. Let me just check for cleanup here. But that's a wonderful shave. Oh, all day long with that smell. All day long. So beautiful packaging, beautiful product, nice moisturizing feel behind. Um, very happy. This guy always does his job. Cold rinse. Ah. Wow, Ladrino, nice job. Nice job. I gotta, I'm gonna have to pick up a few more uh, of theirs and, and really run them through, but poof, mama, what a smell. That's gorgeous. Uh, let's top this off with some Parasso. And then that Gillette did a fine job as per usual. And uh, I love those med preps. They're great. And don't worry, we're going to get that soap shot. Ah, beautiful. Done. So nice. All right, let me pull this soap shot here because uh, I know you guys, I believe you guys like to see that. I know I always like to check the texture. Man, did that take up a lot. I could have built it up a little bit, you know, better on my account, but, um, wow. So, uh, it's just beautiful. Really, really is. I mean, that's, that's nice. And next time, maybe I would have done a smidge less water, but, but again, uh, nothing on the soap. That's all me. This has a beautiful, beautiful feel for, to it. I honestly, it's just gorgeous. And I, that smell is, uh, banging. It bangs. All right, guys, that's it. You know the deal. Please, uh, if you'd be so kind, if you, if you so desire, like, subscribe. Most importantly, be well. Stay safe, stay strong. You guys are awesome. Have a wonderful day. Catch you on the next one.